Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are testing out the Makeup Forever Water Tone Skin Perfecting Fresh Foundation. So this is in the color Y355. And we're gonna, this is gonna be like a really fast, like super fast, like um, foundation review. So I'm putting it on my favorite brush for sheer foundations. This is just the Face Secrets. And look at that. So as you guys know, I've been on the hunt for a sheer foundation. And so why not test all of the foundations out? So Makeup Forever is a well-known makeup brand. They've been around for years. And I've never tried this foundation before, but already I can see it's like one of the most sheer foundations I've ever used. I mean, this is just absorbing right into the skin, almost like it was a moisturizer or a tinted moisturizer. All almost no coverage on the redness that I have, nor the nor the um, blemishes, 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 and um, but however, this feels like I have nothing on my face, and that's kind of nice. Like this actually feels really, really nice. So let's just do it up close because it's really important to see up close. This is what we're covering. So as you can see, it has done a really good job of like covering pores. So I'm gonna apply it to the rest of my face. And you can even see when it comes out, it's like super watery. So we'll just put this on the rest of the face and um, I will give you my final verdict. It's funny, it's like the SNL skit with um, Keenan Thompson where he's pretending that he's in Fast Forward and she's like, oh. <laughs> This is so funny. <laughs> I also posted a new comedy skit on my channel. If you're interested in that, it's the video right before this. It's um, if you really like the baking competition shows. So I've just built it up a little with a second coat and this is a swatch of the Y355. So you can see it's very sheer, but you guys actually this, I'm so impressed with this. It is like, let's do an up close and you can see exactly what I'm talking about. It has minimized and camouflaged my pores without looking like I have foundation on. I actually am sorry, I'm thinking that this is like one of the best sheer foundations I've ever used. This is such good coverage and you guys know I have like super large pores. Like I do, I have like not great skin, but you can see how well that's concealed and yeah it's not perfect obviously but what I really like about it is it doesn't have that dewiness of the other sheer foundations I've tried it just looks really good like <laughs> don't you guys I don't know do you guys think this just looks really really good and it's also a really good color match again this is in the color Y355 and I've never been prettier in my whole life. I hear the swatches again like buffed in and it like it's so seamless you can't really see where the edges are but it's such a good color match for me and again I'm not paid to say this I purchased this with my own money but I'm really really happy I also I have the if you're wondering what's on my arms today the sunless tanner is brought to you by tan drops i put these like tanology tan drops in my lotion and this is the outcome of that tanner so only like a little bit of mess up there and there looks and you can still see some of the redness which actually works in my favor because it just kind of looks like i have blush on but overall, of all the sheer foundations I've tried, this has to be my favorite. <laughs> but wait, there's more. So I'm going to go ahead and finish off my full face of makeup for the day. And that's going to be sped up. So, and then I'll come back at the end with my done.
fun scene. As we can see, I was testing out yellow eyeshadow because I've literally seen so many people haul yellow eyeshadow palettes and I was like, what does yellow eyeshadow at at all look like on that night? <laughs> so this is what it looks like on me. <laughs> but I just kept it with like the dewy um, creamy blush and the creamy contour, which I really like. These are both from Tarte. And um, I think it looks so good. Minus the eyeshadow. Ignore the eyeshadow. But I think the skin looks amazing. This foundation retails for $37. And I'll tell you what I like about it is it di it's drying matte like down to my face. And it's like clinging to the skin. So I th it's not going to like move around. As you can see like you can touch your skin and it's not coming off. That's probably my favorite thing about this foundation. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to subscribe and I will see you in the next video. Thank you so much for being here. I love each and every one of you. Goodbye.